All right, everybody, we're back. We're going to go ahead and do Invasion by Night. Actually, a pretty cool level here. We're going to go ahead and kill that Arachnotron, if you can see it from here. Not sure if we've killed him or not. Yeah, now we, now we killed him. most powerful weapon we have for now is this. Not bad though, shoots pretty quickly and again it's powerful so you know it's, it's, it's it'll do basically. It'll get the job done. Yeah, I really like how like the music on this is quiet. You're supposed to be doing an invasion by night. Being stealthy and making sure no one hears you. Should have uh, picked stealth class then, but whatever. Look. Damn it. We'll just shoot that and hopefully that kills him. Oh, we need to kill him. This fella right here. When does all the hell break loose? Magnum sniper. Pfft. Takes forever to reload and it kinda sucks, but Oh boy. Here's where everything starts spawning. Now he can go ahead and be as loud as he can want because no more not really an invasion anymore. Or invasion by night, you know, no need to be quiet because you kind of already blew your cover here. I need to really hope that he drops the grav. We're going to get the grav in this weapon, the gravity gun. Because there's a lot of stuff that, uh, a lot of uh, monsters that spawn on this. They can't come in here, I don't think. Or I don't, I hope. <laughs> okay, uh... Could've gotten a more powerful plasma gun, but, you know, alright, we can work with this. Please drop the grav. No, but he dropped a strain, this is a start. Crap. Didn't get my preferred weapon. Let's just use the buster rifle then. Please drop the grav. Yes, he dropped the grav. This early in the game is a good sign. Very good sign. As you can see, we basically 90 degree angled that that rocket or missile or whatever. Well, we got all the, uh, not arachno barons, what the fuck are they called? What are they called? All the, uh, of these guys, basically. No idea where the other switches are. Well, there's one in here, I'll tell you that much. Let's switch to something not as powerful. Let's put it like that. Because the Belfagors, as you can see, will be able to kill very easily. Oh wow, we killed him. This weapon's a bit more powerful than we thought. Alrighty, so we got one more. And then I believe the uh, red switch over there in the beginning is, uh, or the red key is accessible, and I believe the next area is in here. Cool thing is this next place is filled with these. Shoot it, it'll bounce around, kill some people. Hey, 
again, they still have the uh, power of the Belphegor, if I didn't add that. Yeah, just fuck it. Just... Crap, well, make sure I don't kill myself. Ugh. So you have so little HP, but you're still so powerful. I like the little door sound effect on that, though. It's pretty cool. Again, I'm not playing with my normal jump mace keys, so if my uh, jumping skills ever happen to not be so elite, and then that is my fault. And there I go. Sorry, that felt like there was something on my hand. Fuck's sake, I hate using R as my jump key. There you go. What's over here? I forgot. Oh yeah, it's the final switch. Alright, then it doesn't really matter. Just run to the exit. Shit. get our powerful out because a uh, big area is going to open up once we pick this pick this up crap and he dropped our uh, strength but that's that's okay hopefully he dropped one wait no he didn't okay Ah, uh, whatever. So, what do we need now? We need the powerful. Oh, is this a shotgun on steroids? Sweet. So that's what's behind the wall, which is lowering right now. See if I, I can show you guys what it looks like. Uh, it doesn't work for some reason. I used to be able to use it, it doesn't work anymore. So, yeah, as you can see, this is going to be very useful, especially in a place where there's lots of cyber demons like this. God damn it, if you fall down here, by the way, you're screwed. None of these have a dropped, uh, what do you call it, a spread. Crap, killed myself. Really wanted a spread. Oh. And I am in the killer. Well, there's a strength. I'm going to go ahead and gladly pick that up. Oh, here's the spread. I was looking for that. <laughs> Now we just have to dodge any strengths that are over here. Yeah, this wall is lowering as you can see. Slowly but surely it is going down. Oh, so people will spawn in here. This is going down, right? Yeah, okay, it is. Ooh, did some damage to myself. Where did he come from? Where did this guy come from? Are you serious? When you guys don't drop a strain or a spread, I'm gonna. Shit's going down basically. I'll just put it at that. There we go. Two drop the spread. So you can occupy yourself with all that while we can then move on to this next area. I'm just gonna go up here to make it a little quicker. Alrighty. So, that was Invasion by Night. Oh, man. I got... I got a, uh, what do you call it? A Shakespeare paper. 
to work on, so I'm gonna go work on that. That'll about take me up, or uh, take up the rest of my night, and then all day tomorrow, or most of the day, hopefully morning, so we'll be able to uh, record by night or afternoon. I'm gonna be working on the uh, on the actual rough draft, which is gonna be due the next day on Monday. Right now, I'm I'm uh, finishing out my outline, and then basically from the outline, I just kind of have to write almost word for word what's happening in the outline, and then uh, so yeah, it'll it'll uh, I'll get through it pretty quickly. I'll just say that much. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys tomorrow when I go ahead and continue the rest of the series because. As I said, I'm going to go work on that. So we're going to play The Blessing next. This actually is the level that has a secret level uh, to it, if I remember correctly. So we're going to go ahead and, uh, yeah, definitely try to see what's happening there. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace.